All right. Hey everyone. Rob Wise Guy 82 back. So we're about 5 hours later because <clears throat> so the video uh my first video back went well. Uploading it went horrible. Uh cut my video at like 3 min or 33 minutes and then <clears throat> the rest of it is another video. I hate that. Always sucks when you got to go to part two. Unfortunately, because this is the first one back and I was doing openings. That's how it's got to be. But then it also, uh, you know, the whole video was 40, a little over 40 minutes. I was able to do everything except the Gradio Active. So go to upload it. Because I, well, it happened because I ran out of space. So I go to upload it, erase the video from my phone, go to start to do the rest of the video. I uh, was doing the recap. I was like almost two minutes in. Looked down and my home screen is on the phone. Well, still using the space when it was uploading. So <sighs> took five hours to upload. So now here I am. Gradioactive has been marinating for five hours. So, like a fine wine or a steak, we're going to hope there's some extra good juju on there. Do a recap. <clears throat> These were, this was really fun. Hot packs. This was really, really fun. You know. I didn't know what to expect. Let's see. But I got some really good cards, I think. You know, I, I looked up the prices of some of them. Some really good players. Jackie Bradley Jr. This is a really cool card. This thing is so heavy. It is awesome. Oh, man. So cool. And, you know, some people have them listed for 20 bucks, 5 10 but each one of them has definitely been more than than, than uh, what I paid for it. And it is really cool. Some really good cards. There's a Shohei. J.P. Crawford. There's a uh, Patch Auto. Starling Marte. Uh in the uh, all-star ballot this year. Ryan Schimpf. George Briner Bell. Uh, so each one of them, there's been, there was three hits in all mine. Uh, it's at least going to have two. Some packs are even going to have five. Uh, there's a two out of 25 um, jersey number card. There was another one in here, I thought. <clears throat> but anyways, I love this. I'm definitely going to do this again. Uh, here, let's... I'm definitely... I think the next one I'm going to do is... Uh, I'll get a bunch of these. But this was my uh, Magneto. So Jordan Montgomery. Triple patch. With Yankee pinstripes on all of them. Eight of ten. This is freaking awesome. Uh, this is the uh, Panini Spectre uh, Gold Prism. That is awesome. And I love the Yankee pinstripes. My first pinstripes. Freaking mint. <clears throat> uh, this right here, I didn't show in my other video, but this is from Immaculate. 2017 Alex Bregman. Five patches in there. So there's like one, two, three, four, five colors all together. I mean, that this one's like almost busting out. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, man, I freaking love it. All right, guys. Oh, well, one more. Oh, no, here, look at this too, guys. What the hell? So these were just a couple that they freaking, that uh, Chad threw in. 
another Shohei. <clears throat> and then I looked this up, and there were a couple of these on there for like 30. One was 50, uh, but this is 25 of 25. Uh, Luke Farrell. Oop, sorry. On card. What the hell? Freaking awesome. <clears throat> those were just uh, some little extra. And then this one, let's see. So Joey Votto, <clears throat> out of 299. Brandon Shipley, Patch. From like, uh, this is 2016 Panini Spring Training Road Trip. Uh, top certified autograph, Anthony K. Uh, I got two of these, and I think it was two of those. Uh, some people got them on there for like 20 bucks a piece. Uh, Ronald Acuna Jr., and then a National Treasures out of 99 patch, Jacob DeGrom. Freaking awesome. <clears throat> So now, finally, let's get to the marinated goodness. <clears throat> I love these freaking bags. All right, here we go. I am really excited. So this is Gradioactive. It's going to be no less than a nine. There's like, so it said there, I think it's like two out of three of them are patches or autos and I don't know if like the cases All right. oh 9.5 tops now <gasps> whoa Cody Bellinger now is that anything guys it's not numbered Let's see tops now Cody Bollinger corners edges got some tens on there third base all right maybe it needed to do marinate a little bit more I'll look into this the case is really nice <clears throat> Let's see any. I don't think that's his rookie year or anything. It doesn't say that. All right, still fun. I don't, but who knows? Let me look it up. So, yeah. So that's uh, gonna be well. Here, let me show you a couple more. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, let me show you a couple more comics, guys. Uh, so this right here just came out. This is Red Sonia, Birth of the She-Devil. Uh, Lucio Perillo. Master artist. Master painter. Uh, this right here is another master painter. This is Kent Williams. Uh, on Pearl, I believe this is, yeah, number nine. And his style is just really, really freaking amazing in my opinion. Maybe not for some people, but I love it. And this right here is one of my favorite painters. Uh, Asian or Oriental. Uh, Hyung Tech Nam. But this right here is uh, from uh, Niobe. This is Arathun number three. And that is just a badass cover of Niobe fighting an ogre. 
but the paint is just incredible. I would love to see the the original of this. Absolutely amazing. But these guys, and I got another one in here, uh, they have like galleries. They're seriously like masters. <clears throat> this one right here is uh, Arthur Sudam. Uh, after the famous Alex Ross painting. But this is Deceased number one. And that is just freaking awesome. Look at Harley. She looks so good. Absolutely beautiful. And then this right here is probably my favorite one that I've gotten in a while. <clears throat> this is Deceased number two. Uh, my favorite, Gabriel Delato. And this is just an amazing Batman. So creepy. Absolutely amazing. Again, master painter. They don't get any better than Gabriel Delato. Awesome. And that's it, guys. <clears throat> I don't think I've got anything else to show you. Uh, hopefully I will uh, soon. I've got a, another one of uh, from a different company, one of these coming. Uh, but this one is all about, uh, let's see, here we go, Hot Packs. This was really fun. Um, everything, uh, and, I, and I'm, I got to look into the Gradioactive, but everything was definitely uh, more than I at least from what people, I didn't go into like the sold or anything like that. Maybe I will tonight uh, or tomorrow when I'm at work. But uh, I got to look into this Cody Bellinger. I just know that uh, my he beat my Astros up in, he always beats us up whenever we play him. So I definitely know Cody Bellinger. Uh, let's see. Third fastest player in MLB history to hit 30 home runs. Yeah, so let me uh, let me look into this. Is it a refractor? It doesn't look like it, but it does from there on the back. All right, we're going to leave it at that, guys. Uh, so glad to have found this hobby. Um, I'm going to make a list. I know I've got some questions that I've come up with. Like, <clears throat> I'm trying to get supplies. Um... And from what I see, there's seven different uh, sizes for these top loaders. And do I, I mean, do I need to literally get some of each size, do you guys suggest? Or is there an, like, you know, if there's seven, can I get, like, every other one? So it'll be, like, four different ones. Is there an average size of uh, these thicker cards? What's the What's the most common? Um, but yeah, this has been awesome. I'm loving all these videos. I, I'm going to start commenting more, I think, and, and, uh, you know, getting in the community. I love our comic book community. So, um, yeah, really excited and, uh, can't wait to do another video, uh, with you guys and, uh, leave some comments. Tell me what you guys think. Um, if there are other of these, uh, hot pack type things or, uh, you know, tell me what you guys think. There's uh, some cool monthly subscriptions that I've been looking into. Um, yeah, man, I freaking love it. And uh, let me know. So peace, love, comics and cards. God bless.